I'm Jeanette Cowden. Uh, I am the owner of the Pamper Pet Center, and this is my dog, Tori, who's assistant co-owner of the Pamper Pet Center. We are a cage-free uh, doggy daycare, the only one of its kind here in Springfield. Well, it got started in 03, and the owner, Jeanette Cowden, she built the facility for her little dog, Tori. And she didn't want to kennel it. She was having to do some work for travel, and didn't want her dog being left at home, and she saw something like this on the animal planet. And I immediately thought, that's my answer. That's what I needed, good place for my dog to go and would allow me to work as much as I needed to work. So I immediately went to the phone book. There wasn't a doggy daycare in Springfield. I went on the internet, I did my searching. There wasn't a doggy daycare, so I took it upon myself to build one. After I had my uh, idea for a doggy daycare, I shared it with my accountant and he thought I was completely uh, off my rocker and I just did not let that stop me. Yeah, what you see here, uh, when I first started, it was just um, land. There wasn't building, there wasn't anything. So we started from, from scratch. We have private suites for older dogs, don't get along with other dogs or don't want to be bothered with other dogs. We have web cameras throughout. So no matter where you go, as long as you have internet access, you can log on and watch your dog. On the floor out there is a rubber floor. It's not a concrete floor. It's very good on their paws. I have a huge backyard where they go out to park and they go out and play out there. And we spend as much time with them out there as we can to get rid of some of the energy. <laughs> Here at Pamper Pets, we have pens, but they're only in the pens for 15 minutes for timeouts, for feeding. You know, if they're having get along issues with other dogs, we, we use the pens. Having the dogs play together, socialize together. Uh, that is an amenity that we offer that a, um, I guess, a traditional kennel doesn't offer. This is pack environment, and that's their natural habitat as animals, is the pack environment. And it is, it's, it's good for socialization for them. And if they're separated by cages, just looking at their buddy across the way, you know, and it's just not right, I don't think. I, I don't like it. It's for the dogs, and it's, it's just important to be part of a place where owners can bring their dogs. <laughs> and not have them caged.